Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for your support. Smash the like, subscribe, and here we are today. So uh, last week I did an unboxing on uh, Craft Geek and their stand, the Bravo. This is the uh, the Bravo stand. So if you are uh, in an orchestra or rehearsal situations or you're doing sight reading or you're doing like, uh, yeah, like a karaoke thing or tribute band, cover band kind of thing, and you need a stand that will uh, accommodate what you need. So we got the stand from uh, Craft Geek, and we've got the light, we got another clamp-on piece, and we got the bag that this thing goes into, which is really cool. So let's start opening up the bag. The links are down below in uh, the description of my video. And, uh, oh, here we go. Carrying piece, your harness. And uh, oh, a little bit of a separation piece in there kind of thing. Really nicely made. It's durable. And uh, yeah, so to me, I mean, I see this ideally for if you're a celloist, violinist, and you're looking orchestra, right? Vancouver Symphony Orchestra, wherever you may perform, this would be ideal or in the situation. So let's get on the shade of glasses. Here we go. So we've got the light. So I'm going to open this sucker up. And this, this product was apparently in NAM in 2023. And I'm interested to, uh, to see where they can go with this. It's a great product from what I've been reading. So here we are. We're going to test this sucker out and, uh, yeah, see where we can go with it. Safety first. So let's start with the, uh, the light. Pop this sucker open. Da, 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 da. I thought I already cut it. Did I not already cut it? I probably did the other end, which I did do the other end. <laughs> All right, there. Now I did both ends. Okay. Nice packaging, by the way. Really sharp. All right, so there we go. I'm going to pop that on the floor. Little instructions on this little bad boy. This is the... Uh, the Craft Geek Lumi Light User Manual. So paperwork is here, really cool. Light reading material. And a QC sticker, which is awesome. Great job. So they've done an attention to detail to make sure this product comes out really well. Uh, product warranty card, that's awesome. So keep in mind, great company and uh, lots of possibilities. So, so far I'm very impressed on the packaging, how everything's done. Uh, nothing's really, yeah, it, it looks great, including the documentation, the paperwork, the warranty card, all that stuff really makes a difference in a, in a company building something. That is cool. And it, uh, sweet. Look at that. USB charge. It's kind of neat. Kind of looks like that Ghostbusters thing. It's really cool. All right, so how do you turn this sucker on? Here we go. All right, so obviously I got to charge it. So do note uh, for that. So obviously battery capabilities as well, but uh, we'll get her charged up, but we'll see how it goes. All right, so there might be a little video after this. We'll see how it works out. All right, so there's your light. And now we are working on this little extra attachment. Way cool. So that is cool. So if you want to hook up a, a camera, I'm guessing, cell phone, yeah, so it's a flexi mount user manual, so a flexi mount user manual. And again, another QC card, and of course, project registration. That is really impressive. Guys, awesome job. So. Cool. So we just got to figure out how this is going to get mounted onto your uh, onto your stand. That's really neat. So, dun, dun, dun. very cool. I'm impressed. Nice. Okay. It's got a, a swivel point on there. Hey guys. So it's got a swivel point. 
you can turn this thing left, right, and then you can turn this this way. So if you want to go up or down, you've got options with this. Like a GoPro, very nice and firm, kick ass. All right, that goes back in the box. We'll pop that over there. Now, the stand. Let's see what, uh, what we got going on here. So, packaging is awesome. So, let's see if I can get the sucker open. Come on. Right. Working on it. Working on it. Wow, I'm impressed. This thing's really good. So obviously it slides out. There we go. Ta-da! Awesome. Bravo Music Stand, secondary box, and there we go. It's not heavy, but let me tell you, it's got a little bit of weight to it, which is nice. And uh, once again, the packaging is fantastic. So there she is, complete with the manual. Move a couple things out of the way, very nice. I'm looking at the packaging, it looks really cool, really well done. Very cool. It just opens up, I got all these things work together, a little bit of instruction manual, but it should be fairly straightforward. All right, all right so now that we've got everything out of the box, here's what we're gonna be doing. Uh, let's do the assembly. So we've got your light, right? And then we've got your cell phone or camera holder. Uh, you might be able to fit in a uh, GoPro. Yeah, lots of cool ideas. So let's start with this sucker. So this thing opens up, basically folds out like so. And then you've got the two flaps. You've got your upper flaps, look at that for the top and then this thing just goes like that. You've got little clips. There you go, pretty cool. So you got your clips for your, uh, your notation, your music, a little bit of a, a locking mechanism right there. Oh yeah, that totally just tightens the crap out of it. Love it. All right, so to loosen that up a little bit. And then uh, this thing goes pretty up there. So let's go to my lowest point. Uh, this thing turns and there you go. So move this out of the way. And there she is. So, all right, at your lowest point, if you're gonna play music at this point, let's go to the center of your notation. So if you got your music paper right there, Let's go back a bit, nice little slope. So from the base to, yeah, you're looking at two feet. Two feet is center of your music. Not bad, not bad. And she's, let me tell you, she's rigid. She's really rigid, that's pretty good. All right, so let's add, let's go up a little bit. I'm gonna just pull it out and then we'll pop her right here in front of me. All right, so let's add, let's add the light. So this thing just folds out. It's got a little screw in piece and there's a hole right up top here. So it's exactly where it's supposed to go. Nice, beauty. And then you've got your cell phone holder or whatnot. And there is a hole right at the front of the mounting bracket. There you go. So let me bring her back up to here again. 
drop her down there so this thing just goes like that winds in and there you go so you could put your cell phone there or your GoPro facing right at you so what's the measurement to the top let's go to the top Ooh, my chair hey let's move this camera up a little bit so we can see what's going on all right so we know two feet from the base to the center of that so if you were doing a a gig where you had to have your music in front of you ah at its longest pull out wow cool all right so at the longest pull out which is pretty high pretty pretty high you're looking at uh yeah 57 inches not bad 57 inches and if you were playing in an orchestra or sitting down most comfortably i would say right about there for me anyway and you're looking at probably a little bit lower 40 inches at a comfortable level this thing is is sturdy right it's not going anywhere let's turn the light on awesome that looks wicked um yeah beautiful job very sturdy uh very easy, easy to use stylish uh this would look great if you're like a a celloist violinist you know uh, i can think of usage for this thing in a Definitely in a situation like that, you're playing in an orchestra. Uh, even if you're doing, uh, you know, tribute bands or a cover band, you're a singer or your guitar player and you're sight reading, this is great. This is a great, great product. It's made really well. It's sturdy. It's not going anywhere. And uh, I'm pretty impressed. Very impressed. So there you go. All right. Um, questions and comments I'd love to hear back from you guys what you guys think uh, what do you use for music stand is this something that you could possibly use the links down below remember and you've even got a 5 or 10% discount using my code so I'll put my code down there as well and this is it this is pretty pretty stylish uh, everything in the bag let's just see so if I take everything apart turn off our light first and then if I take everything apart, take that apart, easy dismounts, everything comes off real simple. There's your light, which reminds me of the Ghostbusters, you know, as it goes up. <laughs> All right, um, this thing goes sideways, that clamps in there, that goes like that. That slides in like this. A little bit of a twist, and that locks in. Bingo. Now let's go down and see what you guys think about the putting it in the bag. So into the bag it goes. Put it on the other side. So this piece in here is. That piece can go in its one little compartment. And you've got different little compartments here that you can pick and choose. So even if that kind of drops in there. Bam. There you go. Simple, nice, lightweight, not heavy. Craft Geek. This is an amazing music stand. You guys are awesome. Great product. I highly recommend it. I'm going to be using it next week for some stuff that I'm going on. But uh, yeah, if you are in that situation that you're looking for a nice, lightweight, tra transportable music stand, this is it. So big shout out to uh, Craft Geek for making me uh, the opportunity to review this awesome product. Cheers. I've been Steve. You guys have been great. Subscribe, smash the like, and uh, check one of these things out. All right. See ya. Till next time.